Hmm, Saria. That's sad. She can never grow old and have babies with you. Gross. Hmm. That's sad. Gross. She'll always she'll always be unable to reproduce because she's always stuck at the same age. How sad. Why do you assume she wants to? I don't think most like eight year olds want to reproduce. Well, I mean, when you're a kid, you're like, I'm going to have kids someday when I'm older. No. No? No. Maybe you did. A lot of kids do. Uh, I don't know about a lot of kids. Maybe you did. Well, no, there's a lot of kids that are like, meh, meh, screw screw the other gender, meh, gross, cooties. But then there's a lot of them that are like, oh, I can't wait to blah, 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 someday. Uh, I don't think so. I think most kids I know who are 10 or younger are not like, I can't wait to have kids. I think most of them are like, I'm going to see if I can put pop rocks in my nose. (laughs) Oh, never mind. I'm, not, <laughs> I'm telling you, I don't know of any little kid. Not, I've never met another little kid, even when I was a little kid, who's like, yeah, I can't wait to have my own kids. Well, just because they, well, it's, it doesn't mean they're outgoing about it. Maybe they're... <laughs> I think you're just projecting your own experience onto, like, all little kids. Mm-hmm. <laughs> sure, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Girls tend to get more into more interested in romance earlier than guys do. Romance? You're talking about having children. We're, we're having a conversation. I don't think most 10-year-olds are like, huh, what do you want to do? I'm going to get my ears pierced this weekend. Oh, great. What are you going to do? I'm going to fuck that fifth grader Roy and have a fucking baby. I can't fucking wait. That's not what I fucking mean, and you know it. No, I don't know it. You're like, I can't wait to have... You said romance. That means there's like fucking, you, you know, another player in the life. You you can't wait to swoon your partner into having children. I'm not children saying she's with... sexually interested now. I'm oh, saying I'm, like... I'm not talking about sexual interest either. I'm saying most people aren't like, hmm, what would I like? Uh, the responsibility of a fucking barfing fucking shitlord baby who's gonna fucking barf in my mouth and I have to change, wipe their fucking butthole and shit. I can't wait for that shit. I love being a 10 year old. This is what being 10 is all about baby let's say hypothetically she She just says let's be friends remember this song to remember me and my friendship by yeah so friendship yeah yeah friendship platonic and after and she she says i hope you'll visit again someday and notice how link is like uh uh uh, and he runs away yeah that's implied to be like she likes me ah I guess you could look at it that way. I mean, I think so, at least. I, There's I a big be difference wrong. between having a crush when you're 10 years old and wanting to fucking make babies. I know! <laughs> Let me fucking finish! <laughs> there was a pause in the dialogue, so I filled it by reinstating how ridiculous that claim was. <laughs> she can't age past that age, so, so she'll never eventually <laughs> be interested in sex and want to, you know, get with Link. So they'll never be able to experience that. This is the same thing about me being colorblind, man. What? If, you, if you're 10 years old perpetually, right? Yeah. Then you're not going to change. You're not going to biologically change. And that's and what's sad want... about it. No, it's not sad because she's, she's not going to know any different. I'm fucking colorblind. You agreed with me when I agreed when I was saying, this yeah, is... pe- no, 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 no. This no, is totally no, no, no. the same thing. People are like, oh, man, it's so sad. You can't see these colors. I'm like, I never fucking knew what they looked like before. I, I don't know what I'm fucking missing out on. I'm totally fine with the colors I see. That's like the, the 10-year-old does not have these feelings of, of wanting children. And they're never going to have those feelings of, of wanting children. And it's sad. It's not sad at all. <laughs> you're, you're basically saying my colorblindness is sad. No. The same logic. I'm not the same about logic. Your it's the same fucking thing. No. Man. Same thing. Same thing. No, it's not. It's. If a 10 year old yeah. has no interest in having kids, and they are forever going to not have interest in having kids, mm-hmm. it's not sad that they're going to miss out on wanting to have kids. She'll never know the joy of having sex. She never will, and that sucks. Like, she can't right now because she's too young. All, all I'm saying is the fact that she won't be able to know the joys of sex ever. That's that's unfortunate, you know? It's like never being able to eat ice cream ever. Yeah. If you don't know what you're missing, who cares? That's still sad, though. Yeah. You, even if you don't know, it's still like, oh, man. I totally oh, disagree. Oh, man. You still disagree? Yeah, I still disagree. Well, I disagree with you. <laughs> <laughs> at least, at least we came to the, the same page on the Just listening. having kids. But can you imagine if you you found out, oh, I'm going to be 10 forever? Yay, I'll be able to live forever. But I'll never know the joy of sex. I'll hear other people saying, dude, I had hot sex with my girlfriend last night. It was so awesome and passionate. 
I'll never know that feeling. Dude, fuck that. I would take being a fucking 10 year old having no responsibilities, eating fucking choco tacos every day of my fucking life. <laughs> okay. Cool. No, no sexual. Are you fucking kidding? I'd take the fucking 10 year old no. any day. Easy peasy.